What's going on, y'all? I haven't done a video in a while, but I figured I'd do one uh, as a quick update uh, for what's been going on here at PCE. Um, as most of you who follow me on Instagram or Facebook know, I had chondro eggs, and now I have chondro babies. Um, still have a few in here coming out of the egg. I think there's three left in here. And there's two that are dead, unfortunately. I lost five. Uh, that one's still got the umbilical cord attached to them. But, uh, so I had a total of 17 eggs. I've currently lost five babies. Uh, one of them had this uh, issue with the umbilical cord wrapping around its body and basically cutting off circulation to the top half. Uh, something strange that's that's been noticed before in, in um, I noticed posts in the MVF or something about it. Um, no one's really sure why it happens, I don't think. Um, so, 17 eggs, lost 5. Uh, so I have... 12 currently, I've got 9 out of the egg, i got 3 more coming out, so I figured I'd show you guys these real quick. And they're tiny, they're really small. Um, this was a Bioc to Bioc pairing, um, I'll show you the parents here in a minute, but all reds. I didn't have a single yellow in the clutch, uh, so that's kind of cool. But uh, so far, everyone seems like they're doing all right. Um, we'll start feeding trials uh, in the next couple days, probably before their first shed, um, probably mid next week. Uh, damn it, this feeding cart keeps disappearing. That one's back there. Three of these I literally just put in here this, like, just a few minutes ago. Uh, it's early in the morning, I just woke up, and so I'm setting up whoever came out, but... Yep, a lot of babies. Um, there's mom, she's in the shed cycle. Dad is... Right there, he's a real jerk. I don't mess with him too much. Another Bioc that I'm growing out. That one's got a lot of green coming in, as you can see. Um, and then I have this baby from Luke Myers, which you've seen in the uh, some of the videos I've done. This one's doing really great. I wasn't sure for a long time if that one was gonna make it or not, and it's uh. It's been doing awesome so far. It's eating like champ now. When I first got it, I couldn't get that thing to take food for nothing. So, making progress. And now that I have this rack, I've got Baird's rats in here. I got uh, my two Loma Altas, two undocumented. Uh, and then my two pairs of Mexican, or my pair of Mexicans is right there as well. Um, and I got this. Another Bioc that actually just gave me plugs on the last shed, so that's a small male. Anxious to use him down the road. Um, homeboy's chilling. I mean, that's about it. That's just a quick update. Um, hatching, babies. I don't know if I'll release any or how many I'll release. I've already got people asking me... Uh, you know, saying, put me on a list, put me on a list. Um, I don't know what I'm going to even part with yet. I got, I'm, it, it'll be a while anyways. I'm going to get, I'm going to do what Bill Stiegel does and get 20 meals in these things before they're uh, even re remotely ready to go. So, <clears throat> and then I have to decide who I'm holding back and who I'm not. Currently, this one's a hold back because this is the first one that came out of the egg. So that's technically going to be the first one that I hatched. Uh, but I, I'm sure there's going to be another two or three or more that I'm going to keep and use as holdbacks, uh, and then the, uh, whatever's left will probably go to homies, so, uh, thanks for tuning in, I know I'm slack on videos, I say that every video, but 
doesn't change. Um, subscribe, follow me on Facebook and Instagram at Palmetto Coast Exotics. Thank you.